Hi, I'm Ainsley. Hi, I'm Stevie. Hi, I'm Diane. Hi, I'm Lauren. Hi, I'm Mary. And, and together, together, we're High Five! Hello, everyone, and welcome to the High Five House! <laughs> oh, Ainsley, what are you doing? I think Ainsley's being a puppy today. Oh, 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 Ainsley the puppy, so cute! <laughs> now sit, boy. <laughs> sit. <laughs> I thought it'd be fun if we had a High Five House pet. Yeah, pets are great. They're fun to play with and great for cuddles. Yeah. Oh, today is going to be so much fun as we all play with pets. pets. in here? <laughs> oh, I thought I heard one. <laughs> Did the kitty cat sound like this, Lauren? Meow, meow. Oh, it was you meowing, chats. <laughs> hey, you're a pretty good meower. I thought it was a real kitty cat. Oh, wouldn't it be lovely to have our own pet kitty? <laughs> oh, wouldn't it, chats? I'd love a fluffy, wuffy, itty bitty kitty. Oh, good rhyming, Lauren. <laughs> What would we call this fluffy, wuffy, itty bitty kitty kitty of ours? That's right, a kitty needs a name. Hmm, how about itty bitty Lauren's kitty? Hmm, it's a bit long and it's not just your kitty. I know, it's our kitty. We could call our kitty Fang. Fang? Oh, don't you think that's a bit tough and ferocious for a tiny, whiny little <laughs> kitty? <laughs> well, we'll keep thinking. I'm sure we'll come up with a fabulous name. <laughs> I'm sure we will, Chads. <laughs> what to call a kitty, a kitty of our own? An itty bitty Lauren's <laughs> kitty. <laughs> oh, how about Woofy? Oh, that's a Woofy dog name, not a meowing cat name. Oh, why is it so hard to think of a name? Well, it's an important job and we must get it right. <laughs> what to call a kitty, a kitty of our own? We have to call it something, make it welcome in our home. Esmeralda. Dora, Pussy Cat, the third. <laughs> Why, that's the longest kitty name that I have ever heard. Hey, you call it Woofy. What do you think of that? <laughs> well, Woofy's rather lovely for woofing dogs, not <laughs> meowing cats. What to call a kitty, a kitty? can't seem to think of a name, Chats, and I don't even have a little kitty anyway. Oh, yes you do! Chats? I'll be your <laughs> kitty! Oh, <laughs> thank you, Chats. So, what are you going to call me? Hmm, let's see. Chats? Cat? <gasps> I've got it! Chatty Cat! Chatty Cat! I love it! <laughs> it's a perfect name. <laughs> They call me Boxy. Why? Because I love to box. Let's go again. Ready? I'm Boxy Cat and 
Ainsley dog. Good boy, good boy. Ah, uh, sit, sit. Good boy. Oh, hey, I have a dog staying with me at the moment, Ainsley dog, which is great, but we have a teeny tiny little problem. He keeps waking me up at night when he wants to go out into the garden, and well, I'm exhausted. So that's why I've been working on these brand new doors. So here we have a round hole in the door so Ainsley Dog can go through, I can get some sleep, and he can go and play. I hope it works. Here we go. Come on, Ainsley Dog. Come on through the hole. Come on through the hole. Oh, oh. are you stuck, Ainsley Dog? Well, let's have a look why. I, I think I know. Ah, uh, yes, I see now. This round hole is too small for your body to fit through. This door isn't going to work. Lucky I have another one over here. <laughs> Come on, Ainsley Dog, I'll show you. It's right over here, buddy. See, here we have a really big triangle hole with three straight sides. I hope this one works. Come on, Ainsley Dog. Come on through the hole. That's it, boy. Yes, it worked. This hole is big enough. So now he can go out into the garden and I can get some sleep. <laughs> Doggy door, the best invention yet. Out you go, Ainsley Dog. There you go, buddy. Through the triangle. There we go. Whew. Great. And now I can get some sleep. practicing my tapping today, making up some new moves. What do you think of this one? Hmm. Tap, 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 tap. Yeah, that works. Let's try it again. Tap, 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 tap. Whoa, what a noise. Hey, you barking dogs, keep it down. I can't hear myself tap. What noisy dogs live in this neighborhood. Oh, that's better. Thanks, dogs. Now I can get back to tapping. Tap, 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 tap. Whoa, those dogs are barking in the same rhythm that I'm tapping. It actually sounds pretty good. <laughs> now I'm a tap, tap, tapping with the pets in the hood. And they're a wolf and a wolf and it's sounding pretty good. Now first, I do the Cause I'm a tap, tap, tapping with the pets in the hood. <laughs> Thanks, dogs. Now I'm gonna try a different tapping rhythm. Wait till you hear this one, fellas. Tap a tap a tap a tap a tap a tap a tap. Meow. Whoa. Meow and cats. Where did all the dogs go? I guess the cats like my tapping too. Tap a tap a tap a tap a tap a tap a tap. Now the cats are meowing in the same rhythm that I'm tapping. You know what that means? It's time for a dance. I'm a tap, tap, tapping with the pets in the hood. They're meowing and meowing, and it's sounding pretty good. Now first, I do the tapping. Tap it, tap it, tap it, tap, and then they do the meowing. <laughs> With the pets in the hood. <laughs> what a bunch of cool cats. That was great. Hmm. 
I wonder what sort of neighborhood pet would like this sort of tapping. <laughs> Whoa, I sure do live in a noisy neighborhood. <laughs> making a boiled egg breakfast for everyone and serving them in egg cups. One, two, three, four, five. But there's something missing. <laughs> the eggs. Oh no, one egg. Can't share that between five people. <laughs> well, there's gotta be more eggs somewhere. noise. It sounded a bit like a chicken. Hey, that's what I need, a pet chicken. Then I would never run out of eggs. <laughs> clack, clack. Nothing there either. <laughs> clack, clack, clack a chicken. How good would it be to have a pet chicken laying eggs for you and me? Cook them up for breakfast. How easy would it be? A clucky, lucky chicken. Oh, well, can't put these into egg cups. Hey, where do the egg cups go? Oh, well, it doesn't matter. At least I've got three eggs now. Well, I'll look for another way to cook eggs in my recipe book. Whisk, whisk! What was that noise? Oh, dear. What happened to the eggs? They're all scrambled together. Well, what am I going to do with three scrambled up eggs? Yeah, of course, scrambled eggs. <laughs> yep, scrambled eggs recipe. Got the eggs already, just need to add the milk. Ta-da, milk, let's scramble. <laughs> cluck a cluck a chicken, how good would it be? To have a pet chicken laying eggs for you and me. Cook them up for breakfast, how easy would it be? A clucky lucky chicken, a clucky pet. Oh, everyone's going to love this eggy breakfast. It won't take long to cook, so I'll just go grab the others. Hey, guys, scrambled eggs for breakfast. Jump, jump. Yummy. Hello, baby chicken. She is so soft and tiny and so fluffy. I'm keeping her safe in my lap, gentle touching with the tips of my fingers. Teeny tiny chicky, as fluffy as can be. I hold you very gently, you know you're always safe with me. Teeny tiny chicky, my gentle fingers touch. I love my friend so very very much so soft <laughs> <laughs> She was so excited because today, Mila and her dad were moving into a new home. Well, Mila, here it is. What do you think? This is our new home, a caravan. Trust me, Mila, in no time at all, it'll feel just like home. I'd rather live at the South Pole than in a caravan. But what Mila didn't realise is that this was no ordinary caravan. This was a magic caravan, as she would soon find out. Whoa! Where are we? And why is it so cold? Oh, yeah! Where, where are 
we? <laughs> ow, ow. You're in the South Pole, of course. I'm so into you. <laughs> well, nice to meet you, Sally. Wait, the South Pole? Well, how did we get here? Dad, the caravan. It must be magic. <laughs> magic? Well, they didn't say anything in the brochure about that. <laughs> Ar, would you like to come for a seal slide with me? It's the coolest thing to do in the South Pole. Sure! sure. is so cool. <laughs> it's cool, all right. I get such a chill in my flippers in winter, and it's always winter here. <laughs> well, well, maybe our magic caravan could take us somewhere else, <laughs> somewhere warm. Do you want to come with us, Sally? Are you kidding? Leave the South Pole? Sure, it's cold here, but it's my home, and I love it. Arr, arr. <laughs> well, bye, See you, Sally. Sally. <laughs> I wonder where we'll go next. Maybe somewhere warm and steamy. It was time for some more caravan magic. It worked! Where are we now? <laughs> <laughs> the tropical rainforest, of course! I'm Mikey Monkey! <laughs> well, hi, Mikey Monkey! It's hot here! You bet it is! Hey, do you want to come for a swing with me? Sure! sure. Come on! Hot here. You know, sometimes I even wish for a cool change. <gasps> well, hey, you should come with us. Huh? In our magic caravan. We can go anywhere. Are you kidding? Leave the tropical rainforest. Sure, it gets hot here, but it's my home. <laughs> hey, maybe you guys could live here. Oh, thanks, Mikey. But Dad and I have already got a home. Huh? Our caravan. Our roaming home. <laughs> I wonder where we'll go next. Maybe the moon. And that's how Mila found out that there's no place like home. Especially a home that can roam. <laughs> All right, guys, let's get ready for another song. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> 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 